All right, let's try this again. It seems like the camera got disconnected last time. And uh, yeah, so let's try to do this one more time. Um, and share it again with a few people. A couple of groups, actually, the Biomed RX community and Biomed RX radio listeners uh, should be listening in. Okay. So, Biomed RX community post. There we go. And share in the group. Biomed RX radio listeners. And share in the group. Neurofux biohacking community. And we're going to share in a couple more groups. Uh, All right. How's everyone this morning? I hope everyone's feeling well. Um, I hope everyone is taking care of their health and uh, and uh, doing well. Hope everyone's getting enough sleep. Um, I got like 11 hours of sleep last night, which is really good. Um, I've been sleeping a lot lately. If you have any trouble good at getting to sleep, I highly recommend taking melatonin and uh, dripping some DMSO on it, dimethyl sulfoxide, okay? And uh, I would definitely recommend that. Also drip dimethyl sulfoxide onto vitamin B12, um, which is uh, very good for the brain. It brings oxygen, carries oxygen into the brain. Um, and take that before you go to bed. I also drip D, uh, DMSO onto, um, what do you call this, uh, phosphatidylcholine because it's brain food and um, uh, phosphatidylcholine, melatonin, um, methyl B12. Uh, and that's what you want to do. Now, uh, you can do it with ginkgo biloba, but I don't really recommend it because ginkgo biloba raises your blood pressure, okay? And uh, so you got to be very careful with, uh, with ginkgo biloba. But it also increases circulation to the brain. Um, you know, uh, brain foods. I guess these are the things that we call nootropics. But before we get started, I want to talk about health. And then we're going to get into wealth, okay? We're going to start talking about health. That's why I'm broadcasting from the Biomagnetic Pair Therapy Office here and not from my office, okay? Um, I'm going to do a plug for a product that I do not sell, and uh, but I do support because uh, it does work. It's called MMS, Miracle Mineral Solution. Um the active ingredient is actually chlorine dioxide. Uh, you can mix, it's a two part mix, okay? And I'm not gonna drink it right now because I'm not on a cycle of drinking uh, MMS at this moment. However, I am going to mix it to put it into my uh, humidifier, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Now, the first ingredient is sodium chloride. Chloride, 
Okay. And uh, the second ingredient is, what is this? Hydrochloric acid. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, if you notice, as soon as the hydrochloric acid mixed with the sodium chloride, it started to change colors. Well, let me put it where you can see the color. You see how it's turning into an amber, turning an amber color? That's the reaction that produces the gas uh, chlorine dioxide. And um, when you drink this, like you can mix this with water. When you drink chlorine dioxide, uh, it's a super oxidizer. It works on the same principle as ozone therapy, and it goes through your body and it destroys all pathogens. It destroys all virus, bacteria, fungus, parasites. It can shrink cancerous tumors. Um, uh, this is, it can do a lot of things. Um, the first reaction you're going to get is called a Herxheimer's reaction, uh, which means you're going to cough and sneeze and blow your nose and produce a lot of mucus and phlegm. And um, you may break into a cold sweat. You may have uh, diarrhea. Um, you know, it, it's just a rapid detoxification of the body. And uh, But what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to mix it here into my into my vaporizer. Right? Actually, I don't think this is a vaporizer because it doesn't use heat. I think it's actually a hydrocolator, um, which uses a piezoelectric crystal that vibrates at an ultrasonic speed in order to, uh, to break out uh, steam, steam and uh, uh, water vapor. Okay, so we're going to try some Let's see here. We're going to try some essential oils. I think I'm going to start the day with a little bit of frankincense. Okay. Frankincense is always good. Frankincense is a healing oil. Okay. I just need a drop or two, you know, put a drop or two. And uh, this is one of my favorites. And... Uh, it's called Stress Away, okay? And uh, if anybody would like to order some of these, just give me a call or inbox me. And uh, I am a distributor, okay, of Young Living Oils. And uh, I can definitely get you one uh, or help you become a distributor. And this is the way you take it. You put one drop here in the palm of your hand. Rub your hands in a clockwise three times, four times, okay? And inhale. Oh, that smells good. And this formula is called Stress Away, which is part of what I'm going to talk about today. And then the rest, you just rub on the back of your neck. Like back in the day when we were kids, we used to like to slap each other on the back of the neck. Um, maybe I will put a little, what, what else am I going to put in here before we get started? A little lavender, huh? Yeah. A little frankincense, stress away and lavender. You have to close these really tight, man, because these oils are kind of, they're not cheap, right? And uh, you don't want them to spill out everywhere and go everywhere. Okay. So having said that, let's get started with our talk. Okay. Um, nine minutes in and I'm just now finishing up with my... There we go. So now we see a little, get a little MMS into the air. And so... Uh, one of the things that I find, and, and, and I mention this all the time, is that um, when people come here uh, for physical ailments, for the, you know, most of the time, it's not just physical. Uh, most of the time, it's um, they're uh, plagued by the, the, the unholy trinity or the three horsemen, as I like to call them, um, stress, anxiety, and depression. And um, this can lead to physical illness. It can lead everyone, anyone to become sick. Um, now, we start here. 
and you can see the magnets. I have, I still have magnets on the table. Uh, we do basic um, biomagnetic pair therapy. Um, we depolarize the uh, pH imbalances that exist as a result of the presence of pathogens in your body. Pathogens being virus, bacteria, fungus, and parasites. And uh, we assist the body with permanent magnets in uh, depolarizing these relationships and uh, freeing the body of the pathogens, right? It, we assist the body to uh, strengthen its own immune system, its own immune defense system with the use of magnets to help get rid of physical illness. Now, uh, a lot of times, like I said, uh, these illnesses have an emotional base, an emotional origin. And so once we restore balance to the body, uh, we're then left with the task of figuring out uh, what it is that, that caused uh, the person to become ill. Sometimes people have a chronic illness. They're always, always sick with something. And um, hi, uh, Mar. Hi, Layla. Hi, Lynette. Uh, thanks for joining this morning. Um, so we try to get uh, to the root of it. Now, luckily, I have the ability to address physical ailments um, uh, somewhat using biomagnetic pair therapy here, but um, I also have the ability to um, examine what's going on up here using uh, neural feedback and the brain entrainment techniques that we employ here at the Biomed Rx Health Center. And uh, one of the neural feedback disciplines that we practice is called um, alpha theta. With alpha theta neurofeedback, we are encouraging the brain to operate within the alpha zone, which is around 10 hertz, um, awake and uh, relaxed, which is pretty much where most of us are right now. And theta, which is a sleep frequency, it's a light sleep frequency. It's not a deep sleep frequency. Uh, deep sleep is delta, which is around 5 hertz or lower. Um, theta is around 7 hertz. Okay, so it's, it's a REM sleep or the dream state sleep that we're trying to, we're trying to uh, access. And at first, you know, you may fall asleep a few times and uh, it's because it's kind of hard. You know, theta is a uh, sleep frequency, but pretty soon you master it. And as the quality of your own sleep improves, you, uh, may, you, you know, discover the ability to uh, operate within alpha and theta at the same time. Now, what does that do? For creatives, for artists, um, they love it. It helps them because they're able to uh, focus on uh, tapping into creativity, tapping into the creative zone, tapping into uh, spontaneity. A lot of musicians really love alpha, theta, neurofeedback. Um, and it's also good for uh, dealing with repressed emotions. Um, we use alpha theta sometimes in combination with self-hypnosis uh, to try to relax that part of the mind and to get these things out. Um, I also employ a technique called the emotion code, which is the product of Dr. Bradley Nelson. Um, emotion code and the law of attraction actually work hand in hand. But uh, with the emotion code, we're, we're trying to also uh, free the body of repressed emotions, of, uh, of, of uh, repressed memories. Of, um, we're trying to liberate the uh, psyche of the person from having a heart wall, a wall of, um, a wall of crap, if you will, around the heart that prevents them from living a, a, a good life and, um, and, and experiencing their emotions fully. This has a lot to do with physical health. It really does. It really does. Okay, so we find out the origins of our negative emotions. A lot of times the um, negative emotions begin with a faulty belief system. You know, many of us grow up and just take everything that we're taught at face value. And um, sometimes, you know, as adults, those uh, those belief systems don't fit into the reality that we're that we're living in, that we're living in at that moment. And uh, so it uh, it calls for a reevaluation of truth. 
it calls for a reevaluation of reality. And sometimes when uh, you are learning things or you are coming to the process of uh, understanding the world in a different and more clear uh, way, it, it may come into conflict with uh, beliefs that you had established as a child uh, at some early, early, early point in your life. And remember, it's like a wall, right? At the bottom brick, and all the other bricks on top build the life that you have. And questioning an early, early belief system that you establish is kind of like pulling the bottom brick out. Uh, so it feels that way. Now, it's my theory that the wall will still stand, <laughs> but the belief is that it won't. And that causes people depression. That causes depression sometimes. Um, sometimes depression is just a process of um, coming to terms with things or changing one's paradigm about life and about the world. Um, not always, but sometimes. And that insecurity of going through that process um, can, you know, cause stress in your daily life because you're not uh, foundationally grounded and, uh, and it can cause anxiety, right? The feeling of impending doom, anxiety, right? Can make you um, uh, anxious about things. And those three, that's, that's hell up here. That's a hell to live in and it's going to, you know, it creates uh, problems with your health. Okay. So it's really a process of awakening to the truth. Okay, challenging your belief systems. It leads to, um, you know, you have to think it through, right? Uh, our tool of survival is our brain, is our mind. So you have to think things through. You have to integrate your thoughts so that you understand where you stand on everything, regardless of who agrees with you or who doesn't agree with you or, you know, who chooses to associate with you or not associate with you because you're challenging belief systems that they are not emotionally mature enough to challenge. Um, but as you go on your own journey of, of uh, personal evolution, you, you integrate, you know, your thoughts and your beliefs about everything and you develop a sense of integrity. Okay. Uh, which is not a discipline. It's a state of being um, of just being a, a person who sat down and thought things through and has integrated in him or herself. Um, that leads us into philosophy because a lot of people don't even uh, believe that that level of integrity is important or necessary uh, for happiness to live your life. And um, people have different, different philosophies. I personally, I've learned a lot uh, from different uh, philosophers, uh, Nietzsche and uh, uh, <laughs> And the rest, and uh, I've also um, I've also uh, picked up a lot from Ayn Rand from uh, the philosophy of rational objectivism. She's one of my favorite authors, and a very uh, very popular and very misunderstood uh, person, very misunderstood author. And I'm not even going to get into the ad hominem arguments about Ayn Rand, but I do thank her for her contribution to the world, which is rational objectivism. Um, as an objectivist, um, we value uh, reason, okay, as your brain is your tool of survival, and man is the rational animal. Uh, that's, that's what separates us from the rest of the animals. We're not the fastest. We're not the strongest. We're not the most vicious. We're not the fiercest. Um, we're not even the most fit to survive. We're pretty weak. We don't even have hair on us. We don't have an exoskeleton or a shell or anything like that. But uh, we can build houses and cities and uh, protected lives for ourselves, governments, police departments, and animal control and pest control and everything else. And uh, we're the rational animal. So reason, reason, purpose, purpose, meaning that you get to define the course of your own life. You get to define uh, the meaning of your own life. I love that. I love seeing that in my children. I love, uh, you know, uh, letting my kids know that they, ha they can do anything in the world and uh, they can do a number of things. They don't even have to just do one thing and pick one thing to do. They, they're, during the course of their life, the world is theirs and uh, you can define your purpose moment to moment if you want. And that's the beautiful part about being a free human being, especially a free American. And uh, self-esteem. 
self-esteem, which is necessary uh, for uh, mental health, okay? Um, when we define self-esteem, how do you define it? It uh, stands on twin pillars of self-worth and self-efficacy. Let's take self-efficacy first because it's a little bit less complicated. Self-efficacy, you know you have the ability to pay your bills. You know you have the ability to provide the life that you need for yourself, the practical ability. You have a skill that the world will pay you for or you have some way to actually make money. And that's self-efficacy. And self-worth is the understanding that you deserve the best life that you can afford to give yourself. And you know, that sounds simple, but a lot of people don't believe that. A lot of people don't, don't hold that. Uh, they don't hold self-efficacy and self-worth, and so therefore they don't um, have a healthy sense of self-esteem, and that can also lead to health problems. Okay, now, uh, what, <laughs> what are the uh, virtues that develop within one as a result of uh, rationality, thinking, thinking, just regular old thinking, right? Um, the virtues, there are more. It's a pretty long list, but the six basic ones that I'm going to discuss here are independence, honesty, integrity, justice, productiveness, and pride, okay? Um, those are pretty straightforward and uh, self-explanatory terms, okay? Now, when it comes to independence, and think about this, we want to talk about independence and tie it into self-efficacy. When it comes to independence, I have a proposition for you all uh, of establishing financial independence as a Biomed RX multi-level marketing affiliate or distributor. That's why I have these products right here in front of me. And uh, wow, it's going from the, op the opposite direction that I thought, but I'm going to take it backward on the screen here. Um, if you would like to become a distributor, then you would be able to make these wonderful Biomed RX supplement products available to the public. Uh, Biomed RX Daily, let's see, Daily Formula, um, multivitamin, multimineral supplement, Optimum Formula Woman, it's perfect for today's woman. Okay. Um, Optimum Formula Man. This is a multivitamin, multimineral sub, uh, supplement. Excuse me, specifically designed for men. Optimum Formula Prenatal. Okay, for those of us who are in the family way, uh, ladies who are in the family way. And you know, men take prenatal vitamins too, because prenatal vitamins contain everything. Okay, um, A D K. That's just what it means. Vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin K. And this is also an, a very popular supplement of ours. Um, brain boost. Let's see, here on this side, we're going to get into the uh, performance enhancers or lifestyle enhancers. Uh, brain boost. This is very good for those of us who are studying or uh, working and require uh, the most to, uh, out of our brains. Uh, Omega 8060, which is also brain food. Okay, uh, probiotic 1150, which is great for uh, feeding the gut. You have to provide good uh, probiotics uh, to the gut in order to digest your food. Now, back to the men, we have extreme testosterone. Yes, this is a testosterone booster. And um, for those of us who are getting long in the tooth, uh, we may need a little bit of help there. And uh, for those who are short in the tooth, <laughs> we've got uh, male enhancement. And um, I think that's enough to say about that. But the products that are really going to fly off the shelves, I believe, are going to be our um, CBD oil uh, medical marijuana products or CBD oil products. Now, very recently, the uh, Government made it legal for us to sell CBD oil uh, in all 50 states. Now, the caveat is that it has to be less than 0.03% THC uh, or less. And um, 
which is, you know, attainable. And uh, it has to be as pure a CBD product as possible. Well, we've gone through extensive research and uh, we've uh, been talking to several laboratories and uh, we now have a very, very reliable supplier of BiomedRx private label CBD products. And um, the distinctive competence of our CBD oil is that we're going to sell it with DMSO. We're going to sell the uh, dropper bottle of CBD with another dropper bottle of DMSO. And uh, what I recommend, now we cannot advertise any of the medical benefits of DMSO. So we we'll have to sell it as a solvent or we we'll have to sell it as uh, some other type of uh, product. However, uh, the recommended um, means of administration would be to take maybe a little shot glass or a tablespoon, um, put a dropper full, of, not a dropper full, but whatever your dosage would be of uh, CBD oil, and then add a drop or two of DMSO. Now, why DMSO? Well, DMSO is a very powerful solvent, probably the most powerful solvent known to man, and it carries everything. If you were, you can actually take uh, CBD oil topically if you drip DMSO on it. It'll go straight through the skin and it'll come right into your body. You can use DMSO by itself. Okay, it, it relaxes the entire nervous system. Um, it definitely fights pain. Uh, it's a painkiller. And um, yeah, there, there, there are so many benefits to, I mean, a lot of people call DMSO a wonder drug. But what it does do, because it's such a powerful solvent, is it carries whatever it binds to across the blood-brain barrier. This is why I mentioned earlier about dripping DMSO on melatonin before going to bed or dripping DMSO on um, methyl B12, vitamin uh, methyl B12, um, to uh, cross the blood-brain barrier and to feed the brain because they're both, it's very effective. So having the um, CBD with DMSO is probably going to put us head and shoulders above everyone else. Now, if you are interested in becoming a distributor of BiomedRx supplements products, I'm going to put a link here in the... Uh, oh, thank you for sharing my video. If you're interested in becoming a distributor, I'm going to put a, a link here to join the group. Biomed RX supplements, affiliates and distributors. Okay. And let's see what else we can do. We can also, um, for those who are only interested in distributing the CBD, okay, I will uh, give you another link to invite you to like uh, BiomedRx Medical Marijuana, and the Affiliates Network. So, how are we going to do this? There we go. Now, let's see here. I'm going to give you guys a few groups that I would like you to join here in the uh, comment. Okay, if you're interested, right? Uh And 
here. Okay. Now, I don't know if these links are going to work uh, for you guys. Please mention in the comments if they work, because I'd like you to be able to uh, come in on the weekends and uh, attend our meetings so that, let's see, I'm trying to get a meeting, a meeting link to, um, let's see here. Okay, 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 let's see. There we go. Every Saturday, tab. Every Saturday, we have a meeting here at the Biomed RX Health Center. And um, if you'd like to become a distributor, especially if you live here in Southern California, I highly recommend that you make it here. Um, and you can also do it on, you can also join us on a Meetup. We have a Meetup group as well, okay? All right, so now you have it all, okay? And let me give you the address, okay? We meet every Saturday, okay? At 11 a.m. at the Biomed RX Health Center, okay? 916 North Mountain Avenue, Suite B1, Upland, California, 91786. Okay, so I'd like everyone to come out, meet us here on Saturday. I have free refreshments, and uh, sometimes we have entertainment as well. Um, it's definitely entertaining. It's definitely educational. And uh, you have an opportunity to purchase a startup kit, which will contain three of all of our vitamins, um, of all of our supplements, uh, one for you to use so that uh, you know the, the, you know, the effectiveness of our supplements. And you can speak from personal experience. One for your display so that you can have a display and one for um, you to open and share with people um, as samples, okay? And, uh, and of course, you can always purchase more. Um, and then we'll, we'll also go over uh, getting your data and um, the manner in which you would like to be paid and uh, getting you on contract as an affiliate or a distributor. So yeah, Saturday meetings, please come every Saturday, 11 a.m. to the Biomed RX Health Center at 916 North Mountain Avenue, Suite D1, Upland, California, 91786, okay? Um, when you become a distributor or an affiliate, uh, a lot of people are wondering, okay, I'd like to make money. I got a feeling that this these products will sell easily or they'll sell themselves, especially the CBD oil products. Um, and you're right. You're absolutely right. Um, I would recommend holding workshops, uh, inviting your friends and family, similar to a Tupperware party or Mary Kay or whatever, um, because that's the way direct sales and network marketing really works. Um Contact your friends and your family. Um, organizations, you can, you know, contact different organizations, different organizations that deal with, uh, like, for example, veterans. You can find a lot of veterans with post-traumatic stress disorder. A lot of veterans are finding relief with CBD. Um, you can find uh, people at the 12-step uh, meetings. I mean, you know, uh, you can find a lot of people in, in different areas, and I leave that up to you to be creative and, and, and uh, find your own opportunities to sell product. Um, meetings, uh, forums, there are forums online, there are chats, uh, chat websites, okay? Uh, 
in Facebook groups and Facebook pages and Facebook advertising. Facebook is very effective for reaching a lot of people. Um, now, the best part about this system is that it's all controlled via our mobile app, okay? So once you become a distributor, um, you will be able to download our app, okay? And uh, it will control uh, everything, your own orders. You'll be able to reorder. You'll be able to enroll your downline by uh, recruiting people, getting them to purchase the uh, the kit as well, the startup kit, as well as the, um, you know, take care of the documentation to become a distributor and uh, put them into the app underneath your account number. And of course, you know, you're going to get your percentage from all of their sales and it's going to go on pretty far down the line. So uh, we have enough of a margin that we can spread the wealth. So this is a really good, this is a really good, uh, really good MLM project uh, that we have. And, uh, and of course, all of your commissions are going to be controlled. So it can't be any easier than that, you know? Um, yeah. Yeah, I guess that's uh, that's just about it. But thank you again for joining me, and um, good morning. Be healthy. I'm about to drink some bentonite clay, which I've already mixed up in here. And, uh, yeah, have a wonderful day. I have a client coming in in five minutes, so I have to get offline. But, um, you know, if you're interested, follow any of the links that you see. Um, you can follow the meetup.com link. You can follow the uh, Facebook events. Uh, you can join the Facebook groups. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Let's see. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Anyway, take care. Uh, be happy. Be healthy. Be loving, be kind, and uh, have a wonderful day. Thank you. Yes. Thanks.